hi everyone today we will discuss how can we create a bucket and then how can we add course to it because i see a lot of guys facing issues of course policies okay so let's start uh, first i'm going to create one bucket i'm putting it as example master ops then we just need to select the location type uh, for now i'm just selecting it for one reason yeah default class is fine I'm keeping the ACL uniform and for protection I'm not using any encryption key for now okay so bucket is now created now the main thing like how can we add course to it uh, so I'm connecting to CLI first okay so cloud cell is activated now what we'll be do is uh, we will see first like what is the course configuration for this bucket that is a default course uh, so let's see it uh, we can type this command using which we can see it now we are here we have to provide the s3 uh, not s3 like this gcp bucket name okay so for now it is throwing null it means nothing is added yet no chords are added yet now i have added one file so in this file we like define what should be the origin and which methods we should allow so for now i'm just doing it for the local purpose uh, we can later on we can add a uh, production level course here as well okay let me add one protection level course as well so if you have to add any of your domain let's suppose i have to add so if we have to add domain then add it like that even if you have to add your subdomain then you can add like that now save it now i have to apply it so make sure to use this command and the cloud storage and brackets then update gs then i have to provide the bucket name here example master ops hyphen hyphen course is equal to file is equal to and then bucket then the file which you created that is bucket underscore cost dot json oh it should be hyphen not underscore my bad yeah it's being updated and it is updated now so if we run this command again uh, which will define which will show so earlier it shows null if you come here it shows null here but now it's showing what are the course what is the course config here yeah so like your course config is done 